<laughs> Good Wednesday morning, ladies and gentlemen, Rangers, June the 7th, 2023. And I'm still me, and you're still you, and ain't it fun to be alive? All I got to tell you is, is enjoy life best you can. Let me see what we got here. Um, today, I have to go to Alamogordo, New Mexico, to be crowned. I will soon be King Rusty. See, they got a king in England, a new one, King Charles the 42nd. <clears throat> Well, I'm going to be King Rusty soon. Well, it'll t it takes about th two weeks to get the crown because they don't do them in-house. There's nobody around here that does it in-house like they do in Del Rio, Texas. That's interesting. That piece of equipment that makes the crowns apparently is pretty expensive. But anyway, enough said about that. I got an appointment this morning at 1130. <clears throat> we'll go get that thing done. Our own order. And it's a beautiful drive from... Uh, here to Alamogordo is a very pretty drive. You go through Ruidoso, four-lane highway, all the way into Alamogordo. Very nice. But anyway, so that's the crown story. Today is the first day of the rest of your life. Make it a good one. It's the day after yesterday, day before tomorrow. It is right now, and right now just went right on by. Never worry about what you cannot change. I'm still sitting here in a Class C motorhome. I could change it, but I'm not. It's 48 degrees outside and mostly clear, beautiful skies, and Romeo is looking straight at you. Old Romeo right here. And the rooster and the bananas. I got one old one and some new ones, but I found out <clears throat> for me that if I eat them basically rotten, uh, we do much better. So... That's what we're going to do. And I've also added a chunk of cantaloupe to my diet mid-morning and in the afternoon, half an apple. Why? I don't know. Nothing changes till you do. So that's a little change. <clears throat> so what else? What else? That's it, guys. Let's do some comments. Okay. Okay, Rusty. Let's do some comments. Somebody leave a comment. Okay. Ralph did. He said, I had the same thing happen to my tooth a few months ago. My dentist put some filling stuff and smoothed it up. She said I could do a crown, but cost too much. She basically just repaired it for 160 bucks. Well, interesting. Thank you, Ralph P., for the tooth story. <clears throat> Paul S. on the RV cover. And just in time for that hail storm the other day, well played, sir. Yeah, we were very fortunate on the timing, but I knew that it was coming. I just getting it was just a matter of getting the cover. I mean, I had everything planned, <clears throat> but I had to get it installed. But I do really like the RV cover, no doubt. Plenty of shade. <coughs> it uh, it lowers the temperature inside the RV about eight to ten degrees during the day, as opposed to being in the direct sunlight. Uh, D. Anderson, do the dental work with a dentist who has all, all the latest equipment. Uh, I don't know that there's anyone around here that does. They don't. There's none in Rudoso. There's none in, uh, uh, what is it, Roswell. And uh, there's none in uh, uh, Alamogordo. The best one I could find was that they, had, they have a two-week turnaround in Alamogordo, and that's the shortest timetable I found. <clears throat> In Del Rio, Texas, you can go in and get a crown in an hour and a half. Yeah, they do the whole thing. D. Anderson, oh, Rusty has good roots. Yeah, I got, I do. <laughs> Joe, Jay Jones on the tiny home. Bro, this is the dollar menu for houses. Well, do it. Falcon Eddie, Mazel Tov. RV Living with the Geezer, check his channel out on YouTube. Porcelain ceramic crown in Mexico, $350. Actually, I found one for $200 in Mexico in Acuna. U.S., $1,600 to $2,000. Hello, Acuna. <clears throat> Actually, it's $1,100 in Alamogordo, total out the door, which is not too bad. So we're going to do that. Hope Tondelli, brilliant. Looks good, works good. 
enjoy it. This, it's fine as frog hair. That frog hair, that's the RV cover. Yeah, it is. It's really neat. Agent 99, this setup you have is brilliant. What can I say? What can I say? <laughs> I wish I could do the same thing somewhere to escape the Arizona summer heat. I'm working on it. Well, that's the only way it'll change. That's the only way it'll change. Yeah, you know, I noticed in Texas and Fort Clark Springs, uh, the 10-day forecast, the last four or, five, four or five days of it has temperatures in the 100, you know, 104, 105 uh, in June. Right, so you can imagine what July and August are going to be like. No, I'm glad I'm here in the summers. Uh, but at some point, I don't know. We'll see how it goes. I'm just going to take it one day at a time. Deborah McKinney, best lifestyle ever. It, it is for me. I mean, it works for me, man. I sit out. If it's sprinkling rain, like we had some sprinkle uh, yesterday. And, uh, <clears throat> yeah, I sat out and read for a while. Actually, it was almost too cool. I finally got up and came in. Yeah, it was too cool to sit out and read. And uh, also, I went to uh, the videos you'll have for today or my trip to Ruidosa to get the uh, RV stuff done. Yeah, it was turned out pretty damn interesting. You, you, you'll like it. <clears throat> David Gibson says, Rusty, you might see if Puerto Palomas has any five-star rated dentists and, and make a video as always. Always enjoy your videos. No, I'm just, I'm, I'm going to get it done in, in uh, Alamogordo. Thank you. Lloyd Conley, Rusty, I just had a crown done here in Oklahoma. The cost was 1200 and Medicare paid all but 300 As I understand it, Medicare will pay for one per year. I, I've never had any, I mean, I tried that in Del Rio, and, and Medicare didn't pay crap. I tried, I'll try it here. I'll tell them. But yeah, it's about the same price in Alamogordo. <clears throat> I'll check it out and see. Well, let's check it right now. Hell, let's find out. Does M-E-D-I-C-A-R-E -E cover D-E-N-T-A-L crown? Unfortunately, Original Medicare Parts A and B does not include coverage for dental services like dental exams, cleanings, fillings, crowns, bridges, plates, or dentures. So you must have something other than Parts A and B, which is all I have. <clears throat> uh, Francis Ebeke, Dental Work in Mexico, the little Mexican town across from Columbus, New Mexico, survives on dental work. From people from the U.S. Yeah, they probably do. But no, I'm comfortable doing this. I mean, you know, if I spend uh, $200 in gasoline, you know, I'd rather, no, this is convenient. I'm into convenience. And that, this is fine. Thank you, though. <clears throat> K-Bob Hope says, damn, Rusty, I see the x-ray. I don't like going to dentist when I have to. Uh, no, that you know, but if you have to, you do. Sashi Smith, hi, Rusty, take care. Hi, Sashi. Good morning. S.J. Bach, I have fillings that are at least 63 years old. I'm 73, never had a root canal or a crown, and never had a tooth pulled except to make room for braces when I was a teenager. Just lucky. Yeah, I, I, I've never had any dental issues either. Just, you know, chipped teeth in the past couple of years. <clears throat> but I never had any uh, cavities when I was growing up, and I haven't had any lately. Apparently, I thought I had one now. Turns out to be an old filling. Uh M. Merlin, it says, if there's no pain, I personally wouldn't do anything. You have plenty of other teeth to chew with. No, you're right about that. But the only problem is, when it broke off the, the chip, it, it left kind of a jagged part. So my, my, my tongue rug, rubs on it every now and then. And it makes me my tongue uncomfortable. <clears throat> and so my tongue told me to go get the damn crown. <clears throat> uh, Shelly Walker, you have, a, you have the perfect setup with... Covered parking, both in Fort Clark Springs and Capitan. Having that covered parking makes a big difference. Night and day, no, it's it's living. It's the difference between living and existing. Uh, Eugene Firebird on the cavity. I'd have it checked by a conservative dentist and just keep an eye on it. No crowns unless absolutely necessary for me. 
they can leak and decay under the crown. Yeah, a lot of things can happen, but I did have a crown uh, put on two years ago in Del Rio and haven't had any issues with it at all. Julie Muley, funny, Rusty, I'm a retired dental professor and I, pro professional, and I can't remember what teeth had what procedure back in the day. Can't see them very well anymore either. Keep my magnifying loose with light for doing my toenails. By the way, we learned to give how to give basic anesthetic on each other before giving it to patients. Hated that class. <laughs> Thank you, Julie Muley. <clears throat> Alice Smith, why did the king go to the dentist? To get his teeth crowned. The joke is free, no charge. Have a great day, Mr. Rusty. Okay, Alice, back on the meds. You got out of the closet. Get on the meds, babe. Sheridan Gay, getting a crown done might be cheaper in Mexico than in Texas or New Mexico. Yeah, it would be. But I'm not going to drive all the way to Mexico and spend $500 on gasoline or $300, whatever. Uh, <clears throat> no, we're fine. We're good. We're good. We're good. This is on the RV cover. King for Day says, buy or move a few more path bricks so you don't have to play hopscotch, especially if you're carrying something or having bad weather. Yeah, I don't even use that. That that mod that I did, the short walking path, I just pushed all those bricks out of the way, turned the car around, no problem. Yeah, it works fine. Tom, hello Tom. I have had all amalgam fillings removed years ago. My dentist told me they could start to expand and crack the teeth. Maybe that's what happened to you. It could be, I don't know. Maybe getting up here in the elevations expanded it and keep caused the crack. Did you get that sound? Keep. That's a crack sound. <clears throat> Bruce Ullman. Hey, Rusty, there are quite a few YouTubers about folks going over the border for dental work, and you should watch those to see how they like the service and if it was worth it. You might save a thousand bucks on that upcoming cramp. Upcoming cramp. Yeah, I might, but I'm not going to do it. Thank you. Yeah, I could. Sure. But no, I'll just go get it done. And Alan McGardo cost me uh, $1,100 with tax and everything, and we're done. <clears throat> yeah, and I enjoy the drive back and forth to Alamogardo. Gives me something to do, something to look forward to. And that, sir, is life. Uh, this is on uh, on the cavity, uh, Wade Lapan or Lapon. Rusty, I've had every dental procedure in the book and would say to just remember the words of a, of the wise man who said something. Sometimes the best solution is to do nothing. True, to get the crown put on, they'd have to grind off all that good, healthy tooth. You, <clears throat> you have left to make uh, what they have to make a stump to glue the crown to. Better to just keep what you have and see how it holds up. Yeah, no, I, w I could do that, but I'm not. I'm going to go with the crown because the crown I had last time in Del Rio two years ago worked perfectly, and it's one of my quote chewing teeth, you know. And uh, so now I'll get it done. Thank you. Victoria A. Messer, like you, town's nice ride. Thank you, Victoria. Robert Outdoors. <clears throat> uh, I'm also on Social Security, disability, whatever. Anyway, blah, blah, blah. I got a lot of problems out of that. Hoping you two will come through as a source of income. says, I'm hoping you two will come through for me as a source of income or second income. Uh, work very hard, all that such. Yeah, well, you know, you, you can... Uh, you know, it's funny about work. The harder you work, the luckier you get, you know. But anyway, thank you for your comment. Uh, this is on the cavity. Scotty Thompson, the mass bowler in Wisconsin, says, Cool video talk, Rusty. Tooth cavity talk, LOL. Thank you, Scotty, the mass bowler. He also says, Cool video talk, thank you. Mary, Mary. Mary, Mary, quite contrary. How does your garden grow? Silver bells and cockle shells and one onion. Nice choice. Undercover and private on the, on the cover. I bought side-by-side -side RV lots, and then I got two carports, but mine are perpendicular to the street, so they aren't private. Also, I wish I had gotten the extra siding like yours, but I was on on the first. I was the first on my loop to get one, and didn't think you could do that without a permit. Turns out you can have a wall on one side and still don't need a permit. Very good, Mary. Mary, quite contrary. Thank you. This is Eileen Toole. Hello, Eileen. You're always saying, being the guardian of your thoughts, 
I read a nice article and I thought of you. The mind is so powerful. What we'll believe is what we manifest in our lives. So believe that you are valuable, worthy, strong, and loved, joyful, brave, unique, and powerful beyond measure. Yeah, that's true. You know, in fact, um, when I taught one year in Refugio, Texas, I put a, a mirror on the wall. Just a, you know, not a great big one, just a, you know. And I told the kids, that you look. That's you. That's all you'll ever be. So be proud of what you see because that is you, you know. Be, in other words, be proud of yourself. It took a while for it to sink in, you know, that last quarter inch through the bone. But after a while, instead of looking in the mirror and, and shaking their head or frowning, they would look in the mirror and, and smile. Well, I look in the mirror and I smile even though what I see ain't all that pretty. It's me. It's the only me I'll ever be. Doug B.H., uh, the cavity, it says, if it is left alone and falls out, you can get an implant for ten to 12000 What a genius thought, Doug. Good thinking. Uh, we'll do three more and shut her down. I need to go to Alamogordo. <clears throat> Brian Barbie, get her done. Wish you would make a trip back to Brackettville for a couple of days. Then get the tooth fixed in Del Rio while on the Texas swing. Yeah, that's only a 1,200-mile round trip. That would cost me 120 gallons at three, four hundred dollars in gas. Gary Bragg, why would the dental dentist give you a filling if there is no cavity? Gary, what are you on, man? <laughs> I said it wasn't a cavity. The filling didn't come out. The filling's fine. It's everything's fine. The, yeah, the filling is fine. It's just the tooth chipped. <clears throat> Uh, three more will shut her down. Alice Smith, well, hello from the city of champions back from Texas, managed to miss all the hailstorms. Roswell was hit hard with golf ball size hail. Hobbs got tennis ball size. Love your cover, but your poor little bear will dance no more. You killed him with that cover. What bear? You talking about this bear up here? <laughs> the little bear by the bananas? It's the only one I got. Proud Texan. Rusty, I love that carport too, really, oh, I, I guess because the sunlight doesn't reach, is that what you mean? Uh, I love that carport too, really, really nice and well anchored for storms and high winds too. You got it, it is. Uh, Captain Trips, good news about the tooth. Rain looks good as well. Yeah, for this area, they need rain always. Uh, Victoria, last one, Victoria, a misser, messer, nice blue cloud. Yep, you got it, babe. Anyway, from Capitan, let me give you a kiss. Here's a good morning goat kiss with one-eared stinking goat kiss. And, uh, yeah, from Capitan, New Mexico, on a cool morning, 48 degrees. Thumbs up. Carpe diem. Adios. Bye-bye. Buy anything you want anytime. But if you think about it, use the link to Amazon products in the description of all of my videos. Why? Because it doesn't cost you one penny. Some of you are. Some of you have. Thank you. <clears throat> what else? Drink plenty of water. Three or four quarts a day won't hurt you. It's good for you. It'll help you avoid gout, kidney stones, and help you lose weight because you'll be full of water and you will not want to eat so much as in dink, 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 snack. And the only way to lose weight and keep it off, and you know it, you know it, and I know it, is to what? Eat less. That's it. That's the only diet you need. And then what else? Uh, drink plenty of water. Oh, I already said that. Uh, take deep breaths. Breathe in really deep, hold it for a few seconds, and then breathe out slowly. Why? Because that relieves stress, and relieving stress does what? Lowers your blood pressure. Is that good for you? Yes. Do it several times a day. You'll never regret it. And then what else? Stretch. Stretch your little hands, too. Dink, dink, dink. Stretch. 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 Swivel, swivel, swivel. Walk, walk, walk. Pedal, pedal, pedal. Exercise your body once or twice a day, every single day. Why? Because you'll feel better immediately and you may live longer, healthier because of that one thing. And then, what else? Stand guard at the door of your mind. This is your head, your brain, your frontal lobes, your consciousness. All those little neurons in there are forming neural links, which is every single thought, dream, memory you have ever had. So, give your neurons something positive to work with. Accentuate the positive. Eliminate the negative. Enjoy your life one day or one moment at a time. At ease, carry on, adios, bye-bye, hasta luego, vaya con Dios, aloha, until the next video.
coming up soon. <laughs> Adios, amigos. Enjoy your Wednesday hump day. Bye. <laughs>